Hi everyone and welcome back to a new video and it's time for a good old haul video because I was buying a lot of stuff in the month of August and a little bit of the end of July and yeah it's it's a mixed bunch it's a mixed bunch we have games we have retro games and we have new games and we have plushies and we have practical stuff and even jewelry and um, some clothing um, everything Nintendo related or like gaming related and nerd culture related and and yeah, I hope you find it interesting. And I have to split this video into two parts because I was thinking first I will show you or talk to you about all the digital games I bought as well. But it's too many. It's, yeah, yeah. This video would be ages, ages long. So I decided to just do the physical stuff today, show you everything that I can have in my hands <laughs> and um, do an extra haul with all the digital games I bought because there was also Steam Summer Sale and the eShop Sale and um, some Epic Store stuff and sales and uh, yeah, so many games, not enough time. Okay, let's address the elephant in the room because I think you saw it on the thumbnail. What's these? These are my new plushies! <laughs> this is um, the first one, this is um, a mushroom. A mushroom. I, I always wanted to say that's a toad mushroom head, but actually, like the toads have white heads with uh, red dots, and uh, the mushrooms, the Mario mushrooms, have a red head with white dots. So it's a one up mushroom. No, not a one up mushroom, but like a power up mushroom. Um, and it's so nice and squishy. It's from um, it's um, the special uh, plushy called mochi mochi or mochi yeah i think club mochi mochi so it's a it's a special kind they are also a little more expensive but they're super soft like the the, the touch the material is super soft but also the squishiness you can really squish them hard and they have the perfect size and they feel so nice and they make me soft and happy inside and i love it so i saw this in store <laughs> there's a special german uh nerd culture store called ebenwald and i saw it and i had to have it it was like 40 euros but and my friend Debbie had the great idea to check out the website of that store and we found even more squishies. They are new in store, so um, yeah, we haven't seen them before. And I thought, ooh, they are the perfect size for uh, my couch, like for couch cushions. And yeah, so I got more. I got a Yoshi egg! This is, this is so amazing. This is so nice and squishy and it has the perfect form. And it... It's my uh, Yoshi plushies that are on my couch sitting there. I have a red one, I have a green one, and it's also, this one is matching my toad plushie, and look at these, look at these couch cushions that look like Mario figures. I'm in heaven. <sighs> and I even got a third one because I, I could not resist. It was just too amazing, too lovely, too cute, too, <gasps> and it's this little Korok. A little Korok! <laughs> It's so fitting, it fits my channel name and oh, I love it so much. I think this is Makoro, so if you played the Wind Waker, Zelda Wind Waker, uh, this is the little uh, fiddling uh, Korok um, yeah, that helps Link through, yeah, through his adventures and he's the cutest and was hiding in the beginning and he was afraid and oh, he's so, 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 so cute. So yeah, I had to have him. Actually, he is the unscrushiest of them all because like this is a little uh, made out of harder fabric so he's not as squishy and as soft as the other ones but still lovely and nice and amazing and I think I will take him to bed with me and cuddle with him and oh my god, plushies! They are amazing! <laughs> I cannot believe how happy I am about them. I'm almost a 30 year old woman and I'm so happy about that stuff. <laughs> okay, now let's start games and we have to talk about something. You guys made me buy a game. It's your fault. Only your fault. And it's this one. Story of Seasons, welcome to Mineral Town. <laughs> and yeah, I've heard of the Story of Seasons games, of course, but I never played one and I never had one. And so many of you were commenting in the last video, like in my Summer Games video, not in the last one, the Ooplets video. Nobody watched the Ooplets video. Have you watched the Ooplets video? You can still watch it. And <laughs> But so many were commenting um, um, below my last haul um, that this is an amazing game and it's so cute and so amazing and I should get it, so... I got it. I did not get the special edition, even though it comes with a, uh, a cow plushie, but I could not find it. I think it's not available in German or was sold out, and yeah, I'm fine with that. I haven't started playing yet, because I wanted to play some Mario, Paper Mario first, to be honest. Um, yeah, but it's on my list. 
I have to play it. I really have to play it. And I want to play more Ublitz, and I think they're kind of similar. They're not similar, but they're both farming simulator games, and you know those games. You can spend hours and hours and hours on those, and playing two at the same time is like suicide. So, yeah, no. E and I did some retro buying. I got two PlayStation 4 games. One is uh, Rage 2 because I noticed that I don't have a lot of shooters and this is not the best story-wise, but um, I heard a podcast about it and people were saying it has one of the best uh, um, yeah, feedbacks that you can get, uh, like um, hitting feedback, hit feedback, and it feels really nice and the, the weapons are nice and it's colorful. <laughs> I know it's... it's uh, 18 and over, so I think it's not the most child-friendly game, but I don't know why. I watched the Girlfriend Reviews video of Doom, and I was kind of thinking about playing Doom. So, I don't know what's happening, but maybe I need an outlet. Maybe there's so much rage inside of me that I want to play a shooter. <laughs> so, yeah, it was just Fred and yours. It's a used copy. Um, I got it in my hometown in the little uh, second-hand store, and yeah, so I grabbed it. And I got Final Fantasy 15, I have Final Fantasy 10, and 10 1 and 10 2, I think, and Final Fantasy 12, and now Final Fantasy 15 for the PlayStation, uh, because um, 13 and 14 were MMOs, I think, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I haven't played any Final Fantasy, and I did not get the remake, because I want to wait for Final Fantasy 7 to be remade as a whole. Maybe I will start uh, the retro editions on the Switch first because I was thinking I was holding off for that when they really um, when they yeah released Final Fantasy 7 for the Switch I was like yeah finally it's a classic I should really play that and yeah it, it's part of gaming literacy I, I think it's the same as Ocarina of Time you should have played it um, if you want to talk about games I think and but then they announced the remake and I was like no hold on I will wait for the remake and then they announced that the remake will come out in episodes and I'm like wait come on no I cannot wait for five years until I finally play Final Fantasy 7 so I might play it on the switch first let's see um, yeah but I will still wait for Final Fantasy 15 it's for the collection actually to be honest I want to play 7 first, I want to play 9 first, I want to play the 10s and then maybe 12 and so 15 can wait. I have to start in the beginning. I know that the stories are not um, matched together so you can play them as separate titles but still um, I want to play the older ones before I get the newest one uh, a try um, and, and yeah, get used to the nice graphics and then get back to the old graphics. No, 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 the other way around is better. <laughs> And I got some Wii games, you know, I'm a sucker for karaoke and dancing games and I got Glee Karaoke Revolution 2 and 3 <laughs> because I got one, maybe you remember my Wii and Wii U haul video and I got uh, the Karaoke Revolution version 1 and I enjoyed it so much, I had the time of my life, it was amazing, I had the best night, it was, ooh, I loved it so 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 much but it's not a lot of songs, so I decided to get the other ones as well and some mics with it because I prefer playing with the mic and not with the phone. You cannot play these with the phone actually, that's not an option, but like on the more modern or in the newer karaoke games like GameStar and stuff like that, you can play with a phone as a microphone, but it's not the same feeling, it's not the same vibe, it's not the same action. You cannot scream into your phone like you can scream into a microphone, feeling like a diva, singing the song of your life. It's, it's just... It, it, it's just better, so I got these with two mics um, together, the official Wii U mics, and now I have three of those. So, karaoke party, anyone? I'm in for it. And some dancing games. <laughs> I also got these at the, uh, like this one I ordered with the Glee ones, it's Dance on Broadway. <gasps> Broadway dances and Broadway songs, I'm intrigued, I love it, I like it, I want it. Um, haven't played it yet, there's the time warp. I mean, there's a time warp on Just Dance, but, um, but yeah, I want to try it out. I saw it was super cheap and I thought, yeah, come on, hop into my basket. I want you, I want it and looking forward to playing. Yay! And same goes for these. <laughs> I heard of this one before. I think both of these were four euros, so super, super cheap. This is ABBA, You Can Dance. <laughs> I like this. This has 26 songs and it's ABBA and I heard about it. I think that's really nice. It's good for old school party or parties in general and not that cringy. I like it. It's from the creators of Just Dance. So yay. That's right up my alley. And yeah, it's ABBA. It's a classic. This one is a little more cringe worthy. I'm, I'm, I'm honest. I'm a little, I feel a little bit of shame to admit that I bought that one. 
but I'm a collector and it's a dance game and it's also made by the Just Dance folks and Ubisoft and I thought, yeah, come on, <laughs> give it to me, I want it for my collection. I think I will actually play it because the Black Eyed Peas games on the, <laughs> um, on the um, Just Dance games are always fun, they're always nice, they always have those four player choreographies. I think this is like super cheesy with like all the four members of the band <laughs> being playable characters but yeah the songs boom boom pout and stop the party i got a feeling pump it the time 30 bit it's yeah they are dance party classic so might be nice for a party even it's cringy when you look at it one useful item i have no room <laughs> in my uh, game card case anymore so i got another one it's my third switch game card case i have the white one and i have the um breath of the wild link edition one and now i have the black one so i can separate all three of them and yeah i haven't packed anything in because i want to have a special order and i have to take time for that and i don't have the time for that but yeah in case i get more games and they're filling up and i have over 48 games for sure physical that's that's wow i'm a hoarder no i'm a collector sounds better I have a t-shirt that I wanted to wear to show you, but I cannot find it <laughs> because I actually saw it on my big, big pile of clothes that I still have to sort through because I lost some weight, maybe you noticed. And like all the old clothes that I had in my basement, they are fitting me again, but also my old clothes um, from that have bigger sizes, they are also still kind of fitting me, especially like the shirts, not so much the, the dresses and the, the trousers but uh, and jeans, but like the shirts are still fitting. So my dresser is exploding and it's close everywhere in my bedroom and yeah i found the <laughs> the new t-shirt there and i was like no 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 no! i have to put that somewhere special it cannot be in the big big pile i want to see it and i want to get it whenever i want and i don't want to get it cringly because i haven't worn it yet um only once on stream but no for the video for the ooplets video but um yeah let's put it separately let's put it aside and now yeah i did that and now I cannot find it. I don't know where it is. Would it? Would it, Would I have just let it stay on that pile? I would have no problem finding it. I would have to dig through it a little bit. I would have found it, but no, it's gone. But I can uh, give you a picture of it. It's an amazing, amazing, um, yeah, mixed between <laughs> Zelda theme and The Witcher. It's toss a <laughs> toss a rupee to your uh, hero. So it's Zelda themed because rupees are the currency in Zelda, but it's uh, obviously uh, inspired by The Witcher, toss a coin to your hero, like the song from the Netflix series, which I adore, which I love, the Witcher series in general, the games, the books, the, the series, everything. So it was a match made in heaven and perfect, and I had to get it. It was at the same store where I got the plushies. It was also the same day I got the plushies, so... And maybe the last nerdy thing I want to show you is a necklace charm and it's Harry Potter themed. So it's by Pandora, they have a Harry Potter collection at the moment and this is the little letter Harry is getting, um, yeah, um, to go to Hogwarts and it's even written in here so you can read it if you want. And also on the back so the letter is engraved in here and this is just perfect because as a kid I was always waiting for my letter for Hogwarts. Now I have my little personal Hogwarts letter and I can always wear it with me and I love this necklace so much I had to get it. So it's just a charm. I had this necklace before but I got the charm for the necklace and it's beautiful. Okay and that's it for this one. Um, I wanted to do the digital video right afterwards but I have no time left so I have to do it another day. But you will get it, I promise. I promise that you will get a digital um, version of my yeah, August haul and thanks for watching. When you made it to this minute, you are really, 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 really nice person. Thank you. <laughs> and I hope that you stay safe, that you stay healthy and everyone you love uh, will stay healthy and safe as well. And see you again quite soon. Have a fun time gaming and stay safe. Bye bye.